Wish TV's Dick Wolfsey is retiring at the end of the week. We wanted to take a look back at some of his most memorable moments. If you live in Indianapolis, you know what it means to be on the fast track. From the archives in 2007, Dick introduces us to a man who does not need a track. Three concussions, uh, messed up one of my eyes, uh, broke my collarbone, uh, got some really cool rods and pins and stuff in this leg, but that's from a jet ski accident. I hit a tree in a jet ski. Yes, Paul Stender is a broken man. For 30 years, he's been looking for ways to make things go faster. That's a jet engine. It's a T-58 General Electric. I have a helicopter, about 2,000 horsepower. Kind of even, it's one of the only two jet, or it's actually two jet forwards in the country. This is the fastest one. Runs about 180 miles an hour. And faster. Back in the day, there was this big urban legend about a guy that strapped a rocket on top of six, seven Impala and drove theoretically off the end of a cliff and, and just splattered himself on the side of a mountain somewhere out in Arizona. So I thought I'd kind of build one with a jet engine on just for the fun of it. He takes his show on the road and to tracks across the country. So I'm sitting in the end of the runway and you have an airplane come over the top of your head and when he gets next to you, you drag racing down the runway, which is pretty neat because you're sitting still and he's going on top of your head about, you know, 200 knots and you've got to catch him. But recently, the idea of going faster gave him an idea. We were at a show uh, with my jet pickup truck down in Texas. Had one of these big storms come rolling up across the desert down there, and it's like 70 or 80 mile an hour winds. And we're all sitting there holding this, all these airplanes down at this air show, and this big tarmac, and all these outhouses start blowing across this tarmac, flying across. And I'm like, man, that looks kind of cool, you know? Yes, everybody has to go. it looked pretty easy to drive an outhouse. But I guess it depends uh, on where you're sitting. All right, later tonight, we're celebrating Dick's 30 years at Wish TV. Join us on News 8 at 6.30 for a half hour. We've got fun, special guests, all honoring Dick's career. It is 7.48. Dick